Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about the difference between Instagram nails and shop nails and also answer some FAQs here on my channel. So stay tuned for this video. Instagram nails and shop nails. So let's start with shop nails because that's where I started as a nail tech, shop nails simple basic acrylic with a gel or polish on top of them nothing that you see like these are instagram baddies these are instagram nails right here these are instagram nails versus regular gel and acrylic nails nails sorry about that one we're going to start with the salon nails so when you're working in a regular salon i really feel like a lot of nail techs can relate to this but when you're working in like a traditional nail salon not a high class not a american type of salon one thing that you'll notice is that the services are provided extremely fast and you're not getting a lot of designs and artwork that you typically see on your instagram account so with the shop nails you're usually getting your very basic gel hard gel um, mani pedis. Um, mani pedis are at luxury as well, but when it comes to like regular shop nails, you're usually coming in there and just getting regular, simple, basic acrylic, and then you're just getting gel color on top. You may possibly get colored acrylic if they do have that option, but shop nails are specifically done faster than Instagram nails. Let's just say it how it is. You are getting simple basic nails in a traditional simple salon you are not going to get instagram nails in a regular salon unless that's something that they specialize in which is the nail art nail art all the glitter and designs and stuff that stuff is more so for the fancier high-end type of salons but for the regular basic in and out 25 minute an hour and 45 minute full set you are not going to get Instagram nails at that at that piece. Like you're just not. The type of nails that people want that are going to regular shops, you will not find Instagram nails in those shops because they don't specialize in that. A lot of those shops are just made for in and out type of clients. They have a break. They want to change a color. They're very simple. They really don't really care for the glam and glitz and stuff. Some people do. Some people do. But overall, in the regular shops you aren't going to really find instagram style nails you just really aren't and also when it comes to the time in those shops you'll notice time is everything time is everything as a nail tech so when you're working in those type of salons they're not really going to want to do artsy stuff because it's going to take time I can go into a whole nother video on time and how that apply, how that factors into nail technician services and things like that. But when it comes to just simple nail salons, you're not going to get really, really pretty, pretty nails like this within the time frame that people are familiar with, which is that hour and 45 minutes or two hours flat. That is only seen in those salons. So Instagram nails, these right here. Everybody loves them, everybody raves about them, everybody wants them, but there is some ugly truth behind them. It takes time for these. It takes time for these to be created. You have to factor in the products that are being used from colored acrylic to glitter, to the application, to the freehand painting, to the length, to if you're using tips or forms. There's a lot of things that come into play when it comes to Instagram nails. And me personally, as a nail tech, um, one thing I've noticed is I do not do regular, well, I do a lot of basic stuff. Um, I do do a lot of basic stuff, but when it do, does come time for the Instagram nails, I do let my clientele know it's going to take possibly three hours minimum it could take less time than that depending on what you want but the more stuff that you want in your nails the more details the more designs the more crystals the more glitter that you put on your nails it's going to add to more time it's going to take more time to do it and you're not going to be in and out like you would in a traditional shop where you're literally done in an hour and 45 minutes 
I can do a full set with gel polish in an hour and 45 minutes if it's like a regular basic medium to a long length you know like traditional nails i can do those nails within the time frame that a regular shop can do it but most of my clientele are not asking for basic stuff granted i do have a lot of clientele that do ask for basic pink and whites but for the people the majority of my clientele they are asking for the instagram nails so i do have to inform them that instagram nails do take a longer time with instagram nails they do take more time so you're using more product and there's more skill that needs to be involved with creating these these nails these art this art on your hands so a lot of people as well i've noticed chop shop not chop shop i need to take that out my vocabulary but from the regular shops compared to instagram you'll see a difference in the prices as well you'll see that in the regular shops the in and out shops the 25 35 dollar full set shops um the time for them and the prices are a lot lower for them because a lot doesn't have to go into doing your nails when you're in a regular salon we're just slapping on acrylic and gel that's it so of course it's going to be a little bit cheaper versus you want these on your hands it's going to take time it's going to take exquisite detail it's going to take product it's going to cost more money so that is something that i have noticed that a lot of people have it in their head that they have this mindset of okay i'm going to buy be excuse me i'm going to be paying shop prices for instagram nails no that is not the case instagram nails take longer to do more go goes into them more products more time more skilled nail tech as well you're paying for the time the product and also the skill that the nail tech is providing for you so that is how that is so that does have to be factored in when you are thinking about getting instagram nails compared to going to your local regular traditional in and out shop prices are going to be different how long it takes to do the nails is going to be different versus the Instagram nails. The Instagram nails are very, very pretty. Everybody wants them, but the ugly truth behind it is they take time and they cost a pretty penny to, you know, get done. Like it takes time. It I would not be charging two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I haven't charged eight hundred dollars yet. I'm waiting for the day. But I haven't charged anybody $800, but I have charged somebody $300, $400 for nails because I've spent six, seven hours freehand painting or doing some type of crazy design on their nails, Instagram nails. It's the time that comes into play. A lot of people don't realize like the Instagram nails that you see, yeah, you only look at it for a cute, you know, 60 seconds, but it took me six hours to do it. And you just saw it for 60 seconds. So you're gonna think like, oh, those are so cute. Like, those are so cute. Like, how much is it? And then I tell you like, oh, it's gonna take about like six hours to do that. Then people will be like, oh my God, like that's a long time. It takes a long time for the simple stuff, like little marbles and like basic stuff. Like, yes, I can do that in an hour and a half. But for the more details you get, the more time that comes into play when it comes to those Instagram nails that you guys see versus the shop, regular acrylic and gel. Nothing is wrong with doing basic basic nails and if you like basic nails nothing wrong with getting basic nails either I'm just saying the difference between regular shop nails versus people that really like the detail the glitzy the glam the artwork the extra va va voom like those type of people that really like that type of stuff a lot of people aren't informed and do not know that it does take time and it does take skill and a lot of people do charge different prices because other things come into play other than the demographic area and also the time because i can do like i said i can do a regular full set within a normal range of length i can bust one out in an hour and 45 minutes but when it comes to my more detailed designs my freehand painting time varies so with instagram nails yes they're cute i love to do them but they do take a lot of time compared to the regular simple traditional nails but i will say as a nail tech doing instagram nails it is a little bit more satis satisfying for myself personally because i am an artsy type of person i really love doing art i love painting 
on nails so i have started to notice like more of my clientele are instagram type of instagram type of nail type of people and with that type of clientele you'll notice like okay they're willing to sit they're willing to sit and get their hair hair and stuff 30 inches and sit and get it done and stuff like that versus you know people that may be a little bit more busier doctors nurses things like that they may you know want to get the simple stuff because a lot of them can't you know have nails and stuff like that anyways or they don't really want that extraness so you know they'll go to the regular traditional shops and they'll pay lower prices so um that is the difference between chop shop nails Ooh, that's the difference between regular shop nails and instagram nails there are other things that go into it but mostly for this video purpose i just wanted to touch on the duration of instagram nails why it takes so long the price as well comes into play and also on top of that i want people to also be considerate about the nail technician that is doing this artwork on your nails okay guys like i know that it's uncomfortable for you guys to sit for a long time but it's a lot for us to sit for five six hours straight literally focused on details of your nails so one thing i'm gonna say for all the nail techs can you guys like please sit still <laughs> please like please instagram nails are not for the week you need to have time to sit if you got time to sit i can do whatever you like you want a mona lisa i will give you a mona lisa but you gotta sit for a mona lisa and you gotta have mona lisa money so that's all for this video guys thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in my next video make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and check out my instagram at drippy nails and i'll see you guys in the next video